Falcon. Nick C has left the building, ladies and gentlemen. My boy's gone. So it's just going to be me, Austi, on the mic for you. Maybe a little bit of Devin here and there. We'll see what happens. He's probably just going to work on the stream instead. So here we go. We got Losers Finals, Venia's Greninja fighting off against Dark Matter's Ness. Now, in the previous set that they played, Venia came out on top in a very close set. Last stock, high percents on both players. But he talked about how he started to adapt game three. He just had to like learn what stages to take him to, what stages not to take him to. And it's definitely showing. He's got that uh, already Dark Matter at 119%, playing very confident. Gonna get a lot of big boy damage off of that home run bat. Okay, he's out of jumps, trying to catch him. Great tech, he backs on the stage. Goes for the forward air, immediately takes away the stock, first stock away from Dark Matter. Okay, now we're hippity hopping, getting back onto that platform, has him at 88%. But Dark Matter is kind of chilling right now, has his PK fires ready to go. You know if he lands any of those PK fires, attacks on a lot of damage against Venny instead. Oh, he tried to go for either a grab because he thought Dark Matter was going to be in front of him, or a missed input pivot grab. Gets the back throw, that's all he needs. Simple back throw. Throws him off stage. Two stocks apiece. Jumps over the PK fire. Catches the PK thunder with a shuriken. Now at this point, Venny's gonna be lo looking for some uh, neutral air, some down tilts, or just confirm off the water shuriken. Whatever. Try to get the dash tag, get the confirm into that. Instead, we're just gonna go into the simple PK fire into a hit stun grab. Very hungry for those dash attacks. I mean, why not? Your ninja gets a lot off of it. Forward air is going to be able to cover the ledge jump. Tries to avoid the PK Thunder playing extremely sneaky. Now he's off stage. Baits out the spot dodge. Doesn't really want to confirm into it just yet. Ends the jab prematurely. Try to confirm a grab after afterwards. He's very hungry for the grabs. This is very different from his set with Sinji when he was very rarely going for grabs. And now he's on the platform, trying to uh, jump off there and maybe connect to the back air. Catches the full hop with an up air instead. Venia off stage. Gets back on, 108 to 116. A lot of full hops coming from Venia. Trying to play extremely safe throughout those forward airs, just uh, poking the man's shield. Gets the grab, forward throw, not enough to get the kill just yet, 140%. Puts him off with the, the hydro pump. Splishing and splashing. Takes a little bit of damage, saves his double jump. Tried to swap. Thing is, Dark Matter played very extremely safe there, but not enough to get onto the stage. Gets caught by the grab, forward throw is gonna take that second stock away from Dark Matter. Now Venny is looking for these forward airs. Hanging on that ledge for dear life. Mixes up where he's gonna land. Fainting going to the left, opts to go to the right instead. Catches the jump. That would have been extremely good for Dark Matter. He is fishing for those grabs. Dark Matter lands a grab, that's a back throw into a dead frog. Dead frogger, let me tell you what. Winner of the set goes on to Grand Finals to face off against Sinji. Both want to get that uh, that win. Dark Matter's never won a Xeno before, so that'd be the only case where we get a new champion. Ooh, I like the uh, cross ups with these dash attacks, setting him up for the forward. Not enough to get the kill just yet. We had the death animation, but. Uses his uh, air dodge to get a lot of momentum, a lot of vertical space. Going off super deep, expecting Dark Matter to recover low, which is why he was going so ham. He's got a stock to play with, so I don't blame him. He didn't die for it either. Jabs right through the grab, challenging him. He knows the win, the win button for Dark Matter is that grab, so he's going to do everything in his power to avoid it. Gets the grab, back throw, not enough to get a kill off of up throw just yet. But now he's at that prime percent where either opponent can land a grab. Going off super ham. With that down air, trying to catch him off the top. Put him in a very bad spot for Dr. Matter to instantly get that back air. Now he's got him off stage at 179%. The babyest little hit could kill him. Maybe not jab, but like something a little bit higher. Maybe like a toddler hit. 194, he's living the dream. Gets the grab, sneakiest pivot grab gonna come into play. Venya clutching it out with that one stock lead. Takes away game number one. Got the bands coming in hot. Lilac, Cruz, and Unova are gone. Now, the reason he probably banned Unova was because of those walls on the edge of the stage. 
allows down smash the yo-yo from down smash to be able to stay off there it makes it pretty difficult for uh, Greninja to get back onto the stage we're probably going to go to Kalos Pokemon League or Yoshi's Island Brawl both stages have those walls for Ness's down smash just to be able to hang out so no matter what he has the ability to go there so Benya's going to have to deal with it we'll see how he deals with the uh, the uh, Yoshi's Brawl stage coming up at you got a bunch of slants on this stage as well as like that middle platform some classic 64 music coming our way Opens up immediately with that dash attack. Doesn't even want to try to play safe. Dark Matter playing extremely aggro right now. Getting into Venia's face is kind of a backwards world. I know, Topsy Turvy, Twilight Zone going on. Okay, he gets caught by the PK Thunder as he tries to du double jump. PK Thunder being a great tool for just following your opponent when they're airborne. It's very difficult to avoid. Even if you commit to the air dodge, they can just loop de loop that joint and catch you. Just gonna roll away, connects that into a dash attack. It's a lot of damage off of it. My boy sitting at 72%. Great patience coming from Dark Matter. Tries to chase it. Oh, and Benny using the cling against Josie Down Brawl. Greninja has that little attribute. Gets the jab block forward smash. What was that combo? Venia on fire right now. He's supposed to be a water Pokemon. Chill. Okay, 92. As his opponent at 22, gets that dash attack, racks him up, trying to go for the ultimate with that back air. Great immediate air dodge from Dark Matter, just trying to avoid the fall. Couldn't avoid that time. Venia is running amok. What's going on? It's only been a minute 15, and he's still going. The damage won't stop. He's got 38. Can I see 48? Now, nah. going to break that conversion. Gets parried. Nice. Back air out of shield. Uh, actually, back air out of parry. Let me rephrase. Back air out of parry. Fantastic option for Rock Matter. He is dragging him. Try to bait out the recovery and punish it accordingly. Runs in, gets a dash attack, waits for him to just fall off. Just goes for the forward air instead. Lock on those damage. One stock away from being sent with a third place vet finish. Thing is, this is looking like Venia's match to win. Looking like a wrap, honestly. Dark Matter needs to pull something out of his hat. Rabbit or something, because right now this frog is just uh, destroying everything. 94% gets the grab. Going to get a conversion off of this. No, it's a little bit too high. Again, Venny dashing back and forth, baiting out before he goes for the dash attack. Trying to close it out with these side Vs. Super hungry for the kill. Again, he gets really antsy with those attacks when he has a stock lead, because why not? If he gets hit, he's not going to die. And even if he does, he's got a whole other stock to play with. That PK Thunder was way too far away. Venya getting the grab, back throwing him. Another back gets the grab, forward throw, easy bake oven. Venya taking that game with a commanding lead, two to zero. Dark Matter finishing off at third place finish here at Zeno 145, but uh, his highest placing yet. So congratulations to Dark Matter. You know we don't have too many nests over here in New York City, but when we get the uh, nest to come from New Jersey, come down and give us some uh, money for our running. You know. It's always, always a pleasure to have them. So now we're going to jump into the final.